If you're looking to buy some coins for FIFA 15 Ultimate Team, be sure to check out fifacoinstock.com, a cheap, fast, and 100% reliable place to buy your coins. Use discount code CHRISMD at checkout to get 5% off all your orders. Hello guys, it's Chris here, and welcome back to Ronaldo's Road to the Euros. Even on my Sunday League video, 10% of the comments were you lot telling me to bring this series back, so... I've finally given in. If you're not sure what this series is, it's basically a road to glory with the Portuguese team and Ronaldo, obviously. I had to stop it before Christmas because there basically weren't enough Portuguese informers on the market. Now there are a few more. There's not going to be that many episodes worth of informs to add into the team. But hopefully we'll get a couple out at least. Also, you don't know how difficult it is to set price limits when the informs range from being discard price to 15 million. Or not at all on the market which is the case right now. So to refresh your memory, this is the squad that we managed to build from the series before I stopped it. And also Paolo Futra, Futre, Futre. Paolo's a left winger. And although technically I've already added him into the team, you know, Ronaldo takes up the left wing position. So he's kind of going to have to stay out of the team for now. But a certain someone has a striker in form card. So that's the plan. And again, to refresh your memory, these are the rules for the series. I've had to change them a bit. Obviously, we went to Legends last time. And um, we're going back to informs. I'm not going to go for the 99 Ronaldo for now, okay? I'm just going to do the inform, really. I just want to add in the new informs that have come out because I want to save the team of the year for the summer when team of the season comes out. And obviously, there'll be loads more Portuguese informs. So um, that's the plan. The price limits are a bit weird. So if we only win by one goal, that means we get nothing. So it's going to be a bit more difficult. Also, with silver informs, I'm not going to add any silver informs into the team um, unless I think they can improve the team. But we'll find out who those informs are as we add into the team. So let's get on to the first game. This is also the first game that I've used Figo. So this should be interesting. Highest rated legend I think I've ever used. So, oh no, Pele. Wow, really? Also, we made it to Division 4 last time. So we're getting there um, for those of you that are interested. Right, moving into the first game. And we have a Chelsea, just Chelsea, just Chelsea squad. I really need to use that Quadrado card because obviously I've only used him at Fiorentina um, with Ibarbo and Co. I can't remember much of this series. I remember large portions of it involved passing the ball to Ronaldo and shouting run. Go on, Ronaldo. Here we go. Starting things off nicely with a finish into the bottom right corner. Get in there. We've got a goal with Ronaldo. Swift return to the usual progression of the series. Pass it for, to Ronaldo and uh, go on, Figo. Get on your bicycle, son. Son, he's like 40. What am I on about? Hit it, Figo. Oh, that's a lovely goal, in fairness. What a finish that was. Luis Figo, welcome to the club. Hit it, Figo. Oh, my goodness. What a goal that is. I was hitting that, like, on the off chance it would go in the top corner, and it did. 20 minutes gone, and Figo has a brace on his debut. I'm loving this guy. Also, I didn't mention to add a player with four-star skills into the team, we have to first score a hat-trick or a free kick with Ronaldo or a compilation goal with anyone. So, um, that's sort of the criteria. Oh, that control. Oh, that is just criminal. What is he doing? Oh, I hate playing against Quadrado. This is usually me running down the line. Oh my god, what is this left back doing? He is having a mare. Get the ball away, you stupid. Three, okay, four ridiculous decisions from our left back. Almost concedes us a goal. Go, Ronaldo. If that's a good ball, you're in. Yes, he is in. Right, I'm going to try. I'm going to try an air japes. Oh, what a finish. You know what? That makes up for the fatal final. Well, probably more like 70% actually. Anyway, what a great finish that was. And that actually means all I need is one more goal with Ronaldo. And we can add in striker Ronaldo. Yeah, because that would give us a hat trick and five goals to nil. Five goal win. Play inside to Pauletta, who can finish this one. What a goal that is. Five nil. What a return in both senses of the word. As in returning to the series and a return from Pauletta, if you know what I'm talking about. Edge of the box. You know what? We're going to try another one of these. First time. Get it out. Oh, this guy's never going to win a header. What is... Oh, my God. Oh my god. Oh, it started off so well. But unfortunately, that one has only ended 5-0. And, well, no, that wasn't the issue. The issue was, I didn't score a compilation goal. That one with Figo was close and... But not quite. And I didn't score a hat-trick or a free kick with Ronaldo. So, I can't get anyone with 5-star skills. So, 
that means no Ronaldo, striker Ronaldo for now. So that 5-0 win meant I could buy a player from an unlimited budget, but because I didn't get a compilation goal, a Ronaldo hat-trick or a Ronaldo free kick, that meant that I couldn't buy a player with four-star or five-star skills, so it kind of limited my choices. I've just had a look at Inform Jose Font, and his stats compared to Carvalho's are basically better. So I'm going to replace Carvalho with Jose, Inform Jose Font. Obviously, the point of this series is like replacing like lower cards with better cards like you know golds with informs so i'm not gonna replace you know pepe with carvalho because realistically no one is gonna make that decision and it just it seems stupid to me so there you can see font's card he's actually quite expensive as well that's why i wanted to add him in now so ninety three thousand coins for him and that actually makes the defense a lot stronger i feel so much more comfortable playing with him and pepe instead of him and carvalho so anyway let's get on into the second game and see uh if we can add in any 94 rated strikers. Right, let's have a look at the second opponent. So he's gone with Soldado. <laughs> Anua, sweaty. I'm approving of that. Oh God, we're in trouble. Drop. No, right, that is lucky. He's messed that one up. Oh, has he though? Has he though? That's gone in without our keeper moving. Thank God it wasn't Soldado. I don't understand how... Right, we need a new keeper ASAP. That's who I'm getting next. No. No. Why has my right back not covered that? Don't even think about scoring. And you've actually done it. Oh, my right back just didn't cover a cross. And I wasn't quick enough to change my player. Embarrassing. I am not um, entirely sure what's happening in the center of the pitch there. Go on, Costa. Capitalize. Oh, that is an amazing goal. What a finish. You know what? With legends in your team, you literally can just shoot from anywhere. What a finish that is. David De Gea just has to watch that one into the top corner. Oh, that's a ball. Come on, Ronaldo. Come on. Pace. Uh, you forgot. You've for actually forgotten the ball. Come on. That is such shocking defending from me. Oh, as if he's just got past me there. That touch just completely did me. How I defend is sticking people in front of the players when they're running at you and when they just don't make a challenge like that, there's not a lot you can do. Go on, Ronaldo, go on. Oh, get a Walker, have a day off. Right, to prove that I have lost fairly unfairly, I'm just going to show you those stats. He's actually scored three goals with two shots. The kind of stats every FIFA player dreams of seeing from their opponents. Right, I'm going to... I'm going to do this, and then I'm going to hit it, and it's going to go in the... No, because Ronaldo's forgotten to actually kick the ball. I genuinely did press... Go on, put that one in. That'll make up for it. Here you go. Oh, the run. The run. That is such a nice... Right, you know what we do in this situation. Goal for Ronaldo as well. That's two for him. Oh, oh the, yeah, if in doubt. Edge of the area every time. Oh, that is... No. I did not pass that there. I just didn't. How has he got the ball from... No, no, he's not scoring from this. I got this. Oh, God, maybe I don't. Good save. Out. No, no, he's... Oh, no, that's got to be offside. Oh, I, I've actually been beaten by this guy who's had about three shots. Wow, that touch from Rooney. Even Ronaldo can't do that. Oh, my God, of course, it's gone straight back to him. Wow, come on, come on. Ronaldo, he can't do anything against Carl Walker. Ronaldo's actually met his match. Like, Carl Walker genuinely has him in his back pocket. Right, and that's the end of the game. I've actually lost that one. That's actually happened. I don't know how I've lost that, but I literally didn't create anything. He just had Ronaldo in his back pocket and got lucky at the vital times in the game. So, fair enough. I've lost that one. That means we don't add any players into the team. So, it's a bit disappointing. But what can you do? Right, um, this guy has Beerhoff, I think. is Yeah, that's the legend, isn't it? Yeah, that's a very solid Bundesliga squad. That's very solid. I'm worried. Come on, Ronaldo. Right, Pischek is strong. And, you know, if he's any Carl Walker, then he'll have you in his back pocket for the whole game. So, let's avoid him. Get away from Boateng, too. This is nice. This is nice. I'm loving this, Ronaldo. Why? Right, play this in to no one in particular. Okay. Oh, Ronaldo, finish. Oh, that's a great finish. What a goal that is. Little scissor kick. Little scissor yep. Gotta love the entirely unnecessary scissor kick. Ronaldo, come on. St keep the pace up. He's just he's just not that good, this informed Ronaldo. We'll take the free kick. No, um, no, we won't. No, we really won't. Ronaldo, that's a nice touch. Come on, keep the ball. Finish that one. Oh, what a save. Is that Neuer? I bet it is. Ronaldo, you are putting this one in the top corner every day of the week. Get it out. Get it out. Hummels, don't. Oh, I thought I was in the top corner. You know what? Little roulette. Nice. Loving that. Loving that. Lo oh. All right, come on, Figo. It's it's time to shine again, I think. Put this one in. Come on. Oh my 
goodness. What a finish. That is a compilation goal from Luis Figo. Get in there. Manuel Neuer literally could do nothing about that. Straight from kickoff. What a finish from Figo. He even falls over taking the shot. I've never seen that animation before. Look. <laughs> yes. Here we go. Luis Figo compilation goal on Figo. Ref. He's at Okay, he's given this one this time. Thank you. Jao Moutinho thinks he's taken this one, does he? Ronaldo, can you stop staring down Neuer and can we get on with the game? Thank you. There's still time to get a Ronaldo... Whatever it is, there's still time to get one. Wait, no. Wait, I don't even need uh, Ronaldo. We got a compilation goal, so I just need... I need two more goals. Why have I been going for compilation goals? Two more goals and we can get striker Ronaldo. Don't score. Paolo Futre. No, it's, it's Costa. Embarrassing. Ronaldo at the back post. Get in there. What's he given? What? 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 Why has that goal not stood? Win it, Pepe. Oh, Behoff just wins everything. Muller, behave, behave, Thomas. Thomas, 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 Thomas. I've ruined it. I've actually ruined it. Ah, oh, that's the end of the game. I've, oh, I've let another one go without getting the... Uh, I mean, no, it's, it's still a win, so I can't really complain, but could have uh, been on to... Better things. So after that win by three goals to one, that meant I could buy a player from a budget of 15k and technically with four star or five star skills if I wanted to because we got that compilation goal from Figo. So in the time I stopped the series, Anthony Lopez actually managed to get himself a second in form. So finally I can upgrade the goalkeeper. Admittedly, it's to the same guy, but he does have a very solid card now. He's still only six foot, which is a bit annoying, but... It's an improvement at least. So that's how the team's going to look for the end of this episode. Unfortunately, we haven't managed to get Ronaldo, as I said. But next episode is where we're going to we're gonna turn it up a bit. So thank you for watching, guys. I hope you have enjoyed the episode. Please make sure to go check out the last one, which was about three, four months ago now. Uh, but go check it out for what it's worth. Thank you for watching. Make sure to leave a like on the video if you uh, are enjoying this series being back. Make sure to subscribe to my channel as well if you enjoyed it. Also, I'm going to be doing another one of these series soon uh with brazil so stay tuned on that it's going to be like neymar's road to the world cup but not exactly like it so i just want something i can regularly upload in fifa and you know a bit of a road to glory so that's going to come soon when we've sort of finished this because there's only really one more episode of this that i can actually do uh maybe a couple more but we'll see so thank you for watching guys i hope you have enjoyed it and i shall see you later